yesterday, Shannon. Mahomes dished out another no-look pass. This one goes for 56-yard touchdown. Mahomes finishes the day with over 350 passing yards, three touchdowns, but three interceptions as well. So, Shannon, give Pat Mahomes a letter grade for yesterday. I gave him a C because he kept both teams in the ball game. He, you saw the, the exquisiteness, the greatness of Patrick Mahomes, and then you saw, like, bro, what you doing? It's okay to run the football and punt it. You don't all – I think sometimes, Skip, and, and that's what great greatness is. I mean, you, you, you see guys and they do, they're, they're great, they're historically great, and they just – bro, why are you trying to force the ball? Now, I will give uh, Jerry Jewell, he made two incredible interceptions. He has exquisite hands for a linebacker because he made a couple of those plays. I'm like, bro, you must have played a play tight end. You must have been a running back or something. Mm. Ain't no way you know linebacker just got hands like that the way he's plucking the ball, mm. Skip. I'm talking about the ball ain't bobbling. Ain't like he caught it with his chest. He's stealing the ball like this. And he's jumping up and catching the ball. They up, a 20, they up 27, 27 nothing. Mm. And then he turns the ball back over, gets the Broncos back into the ball game. They take a leather lead, and he gets the Broncos back in the ball game with a terrible interception. And, 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 and that's – plus, I, I don't trust the, their defense, Skip. The Broncos scored nine points the previous week. They're having trouble scoring touchdowns, and they gave them 28. Now, to, 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 to defend them a little bit, Mahomes didn't do them any credit, get, didn't do them any favors mm. by turning the ball over and giving them short fields. But you can't – I mean, there are certain things you just can't do. Turnovers gets you beat. I don't care how great you are. And – but that's what you just – I mean, you look at what he's done to, 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 in the AFC West. If he's 15-0 – in AFC road games. He's 10 and 0 against Denver. Mm -hmm. I never thought I'd see today somebody could just beat us 10 straight times. Mm -hmm. That's that's I, I oh, it just it just it just it just, break, it just breaks my heart that that this is where we are and I've already seen the E already X'd out on the Broncos. We're eliminated from the playoffs. Yep. I I, I never thought I would see that day after we got Russell Wilson. We had all these other quarterbacks. If I wasn't expecting that, I'm going to be straight up honest. I don't think anybody, any Bronco country was expecting anything with the quarterbacks we had. No. But with Russell, there was a renewed hope. I was talking to people. I was talking to guys, and there was a buzz. Man, hey, I think this is going to be it. And it's another season of disappointment. But I gave him a C-skip because he, he threw for 352 yards, three touchdowns. He but did. those interceptions were Horrible. So he was just average, even though he threw for 352. Okay. I'm going to give your man, my homeboy, a B minus because they did win the game. And to your point, 15 and 0 on the road is 15 and 0 on the road. Yes. And I know that doesn't have anything to do directly with yesterday, yeah. but it's extraordinary. Oh, it is. And a, what is it? 10 and 0 against Denver is extraordinary. <laughs> I, I, I give it up to those. But now let's go back to the Globetrotter play that he, he makes one a day what like a every Sunday. Yeah. And if we could see it one more time. You're talking about the one of Jared McKinnon? Yeah. <laughs> so th this is the play of the day in the National Football League because th this is what he does. Why does he do it? It's kind of a no-look. I mean, he just, th he just skipped it. Flip. Like a basketball. Yeah. And why? He always doing something against us. Skip, you remember he put the ball in he his did. left hand to throw to Tyree he, he when Von Miller was chasing him. He, he always did. does this bull job against us. Okay, why does he get away with these? Because no other quarterback has <laughs> the license to do that because if any other quarterback even tried to do that, they would get called on the carpet by their coordinator and head coach. We don't do that. Yeah. Right? I was wondering what the hell he was doing, Skip, because he didn't even look at the guy. No. I'm like, bro, what are you? Oh, <coughs> that's what he's doing. Jeez. Okay, so he'll pull one of those off. But unfortunately, it, it gets undercut by the fact that he has so little pocket discipline. His footwork is atrocious to yes. me, but, but I've been studying the game for a long time. He gets away with near murder because his coach loves him to a fault. Mm -hmm. And when he pulls that play off that we just saw, it also makes Andy Reid look like even more of a, I'm a genius. I selected this guy. I picked him when nobody else really wanted him. Okay, I got but that. But you knew what was coming, didn't you? You know if he pulled something like this off early in the ball game, okay. you know what's coming. Okay. He's about to try some of everything. It, it, it's sort of like LeBron makes his first three or four threes, <laughs> and then you know what's going to happen. He's going to shoot 12 of them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got a heat check. We got a heat okay. check. It's a heat check. But the point is, 
He pulls off the – he had two more. Look, real quick, can we see the two other touchdown passes? Because the one to Juju, it's, it's just off the charts great. <laughs> I, I got to tell you. Okay, here's the first touchdown pass. This That's the second one to that, McKinnon. To McKinnon. Okay, so I got that one. But here's the, here's the one. He wheels and he spins and he 360s and he throws it. I don't even know how he did it. Right. And he got it to Juju for a short touchdown. Okay, so I, I – I give you those, and that's why I'm going to give him a B minus. But he was very fortunate that Russell Wilson was actually playing. I think his best game that was his best game of the season, right? That was his best game. Yes. And it's 12-16 left in the fourth quarter, and Russ takes off on a scramble. And you notice Russ had a bunch of rush yards yesterday, didn't he? Have it up where he was the leading rusher for the team. Yeah, yeah, four for 57. Okay, four for 57. But he took off on one ill-fated soiree toward the goal line. And this happened. He gets his head crushed into the yeah, they, turf. Yeah, they, they, put, a, they okay. put a knot on his head. Yeah. <laughs> they put a knot on his head. He got pounded kind of on the top of the head and got smashed it, into the turf. And it went, all his head, went head first to the yeah. ground. Okay. Look at this. And, and I think he was pretty much out. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, absolutely. He looked out. Yeah, he me. did. Okay. So he's out of the game in concussion protocol, and Rippon comes in, and now you got a chance to survive the game because right. Patrick's going to throw three interceptions. If we could just see him bang, bang, bang real quick. They're just horrible. They're, yeah. they're always bad ideas. They're careless. That's what bothers me about Patrick Mahomes. That's why I can't quite wrap my arms around him. They're just careless. I think Sertan that, that was Sertan. That, that, that was a heck of a play. Yeah, it was. Skip, that was a heck of a pick by Drew the Jewel. Yeah. Watch this pick. Skip, there ain't a whole lot of linebackers making this pick. Look yeah. at that. He snatched it right <laughs> out of the sky. Okay? So the, the point is you, you, you undercut, you cancel out yeah. all of your greatness all the, yes. with, with this careless badness. Right. And, and it just disturbs me. It's why I think they will fall short of getting back to the Super Bowl, even though he's obviously good enough to lift them into a Super yes. Bowl if he could just clean up the act. And it is an act that is playing Broadway almost every Sunday because this is what Andy Reid loves. That's why I gave him a C, Skip. Okay. The, the, the three touchdowns, the 352, yeah. and then you throw three interceptions. You kept the Broncos in the game. You allowed, you allowed both teams to stay in this ball game by your play on both sides of the ball. You helping them, and then you helping your team. I actually think – your Broncos would have had a big signature win if Russ hadn't gotten concussed. I, I think they could but, have but pulled Skip, it off. But the, uh, what you call him? Uh, uh, Ripping came in and threw a touchdown to Judy on fourth down. I, I got it. But then he threw a horrendous interception yeah. where he just got caught Skip, and just he, threw it up for I Russ. don't understand. Skip, he's running. So he feels the pressure, and he thinks yeah. he can stop. It was almost like the Joe Montana when he got hit yeah. in the back in the championship game. Yeah, I agree. Uh, it was – yeah, I, I agree with you, Skip. I – I mean, I'm looking at their schedule. I think they got the Raiders. They got the Broncos again. They're at the Texans this week. Yeah. I, I just – it's I just – it, it's they – need, they need to – it looks like – I don't know. Unless something unforeseen happened to Buffalo, they're probably going to have to take their show on the road. I think they will. And maybe it'll come down to having to go up against Josh Allen. Mm-hmm. But Joe, Joe Burrow says I might have a little 